This show is supposed to be about balls, weenies, balls. Not today. Hello everyone, we're back with Dun Dun Dun. This is episode seven. Last time Ira encounters a yokai who claims to be her mother. So let's watch before we start. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe, and turn on the notification bell so you don't miss a video from us. And this episode will be available uncut on our Patreon where we also have early access and other benefits and we also have a Discord. All the links will be in the description. What is going on? It looks like we're running for our lives. No, it's actually scary. Can we get whacked? Yeah. yeah. Oh, she was she was having a flashback. That was having a flashback. Either she was getting chased, or yeah, somebody took her kid from her. That's why she was, was so claiming. frantic. Oh my god. This is a difficult area to fight in, too. Oh no! She got her. Okay, toes. toes. She looks like she's very nice. She's just like acting like she a just, mother who's yeah. kid was stolen from her. I would act this way, too. Yeah. Damn. Oh yeah, because she was jumping all over the top. She got herself stuck. <laughs> Watch her have scissors. I wish she could do that too. That's smart. <laughs> this gonna make the whole place collapse if we destroy all the beams. <laughs> <gasps> we could rip our hair that way too. Mm. There we go. We headbutted her. Sound like that. It's his whole body. <laughs> Good job. Okay, we got potential then. <laughs> Posing. <laughs> it's not there? It flew out? Oh my god. Oh, okay. Thank god. Now it is. Look! It's one of your balls! It's back home to its owner. I mean, is she able to like give it back to him? Or we gotta get both? Oh! What do you mean? Damn. That's why she was like fidgeting around and I I she was checking a pulse or something. Well, bring her back. <laughs> we gotta figure out a way. Probably what's gonna happen. Dead. I don't think that's the end for her yet. I hope not. So Maybe when she come back to life, she'll act like a new person, and then she won't go back to her old ways. You see, you killed the old me. <laughs> I'm a new, it's a new me. That's the only way I'll accept this. <laughs> <laughs> she can't be acting not like a me now nice. no more. <laughs> like, if she can still be, like, the whole pretty, like, I'm the prettiest, like, yeah. go ahead. But don't be me. No pulse? <laughs> Oh, they not ordinary, but she is. Hey, even with the ball? That could even save her. Do we gotta give up a ball for her? I mean, technically, a man don't need two. You can just live off of one. Granny. Oh my. Oh. But I don't think she can do much anymore, right? Maybe she can give up her something and then she can bring her back to life. <laughs> Cause how else this is a better way? Oh, look at her hair. Yeah, see, yeah, she. 
電池がなければモーターは動かないでしょアイラの消えかかってるオーラを私のオーラで補うのよ You see I'm telling you she a good sacrifice she wanna sacrifice Which, whatever you want to call her. I feel bad. She said, now I can't eat people. So, like, that's, like, the one thing I can give you. Like, she ain't really meaning it. Uh. Augment her aura with your own. That is interesting. Oh, she looks so scary. Oh, that's a dress? Is she wearing that dress? <laughs> oh, that's her baby. <laughs> that probably got taken away or whatever. Dang. So she worked that kind of job to provide for her daughter? I got scared <laughs> for a second. I was like, why are you not moving? She's so tired. She's working like 20 jobs a day to support support herself and her baby. Oh yeah, there's the dress. It was for her to for her performance or whatever. Yeah. I knew this was gonna be sad. She was so happy and loved despite her circumstances. Was that her pen? Her husband? Because I was going to say, I don't even know if she's in like that Ooh. life. What life? Like she hits it for her to have a pimp. Is that really she? Oh, I not that we're implying that. Or she owes money. I don't. No, oh, they're taking the. Oh, this is what's. <laughs> oh, this was the scene in the beginning of the episode where her looking. No, yeah, that's what I was waiting for it when it started raining. This whole scene is insane. Is she falling? Oh, they knew how to end that. Oh, oh my god. There was a thud. Oh, she found her. And that imprinted but was on she her. already dead? No, yeah, she was. I think she was already dead. She lost her mother and then she lost her kid. So she thought about her. She thought about her daughter when she saw. Her younger. Oh, she's remembering now. It's like she's like wandering, wandering aimlessly. Yeah, and I triggered it. So all we saw was just the wrath of a mother that lost her child. What happened to that girl? What happened to her daughter though? Was she seeing all that? I think so. That's why we were because of the connection. I think she was seeing. She's leaving regrets behind so she won't be able to rest in peace. Oh, she deserves to rest. Bro, she withering away and you still can feel like see her she called her mommy i knew it i knew it I she just needed you. to hear that she did that. so she could rest in peace 
も彼女たちを傷つけたりしない幸せで優しい世界へ Supposed to have a good time watching this. <sighs> they really surprised us with this episode. I want to say what I think was happening to the mother was that she was like a sex worker. And on top of that, she was working a lot of like um part-time jobs to support her daughter and um either that man was a spouse her baby daddy a pimp loan shark and um he came in wanting more money than what she was given and she didn't have enough so they were like all right to pay your debt or pay what you owe we're gonna take your child instead and you know she fought back the best way she could i went looking for her daughter as any mother would and they drove off and then they showed her doing that that beautiful scene with her doing that dance and um it looked like she was falling and then there was kind of like a thud crack sound so i don't know if that meant she was falling and she killed herself yeah like she had I would ended too. herself ended her life you should not live out and no, or yeah, live your child huh i was like you should not outlive your child your out no your child should not outlive you. no whatever the fuck i was just trying to anyways <laughs> anyways it looked like um, that's what they were symbolizing when she had, when she was dancing, that she had jumped to her death. Which is so unfortunate. It's like, why couldn't she save her daughter? Like, is there no other way, no one to call, no one to, like, for her to just end it all? What's her daughter doing now? Like, is her daughter even alive? Is she being trafficked? Is her daughter being trafficked? Like, I don't know. Like, because I'm just, because they were very, like, vague about it. But they told the story in such a beautiful way. It was so sad. It reminds me of um, Demon Slayer. Tanjo and the demons and the demons always had a sad backstory you know what I mean but this was a it was a surprise that an anime like this could um can also will give you comedy but you know will also make you cry like you know but that was that's what makes it really great but I guess we were having too much fun for too long they were like here damn now what now you sad probably next episode we're gonna go back to balls It was a great episode. Beautiful. Very, very beautiful. Wow. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe and check out our Patreon for the uncut version. And we'll see you in the next video. Bye.